An 84-year-old male patient was admitted with rectal bleeding. Hemoglobin was 11 grams per deciliter. Gastroscopy showed minute prepyloric erosions and erosions in the duodenal bulb. The remaining duodenum was normal. During colonoscopy, multiple diverticula were seen, additionally fresh blood and coagula. After intubation of the terminal ileum, fresh blood was visible and a small diverticulum. Capsule endoscopy was performed immediately after colonoscopy in search of the origin of mid-gastrointestinal bleeding. Real-time viewers showed active bleeding presumably in the upper small bowel. Consecutively, data were downloaded and analyzed immediately after visualization of the colon. Capsule tracing software on the left side of the monitor was helpful to localize the first small blood clot to the first jejunal loop. Close to the second jejunal loop, active bleeding was seen. In this situation, blood filling the lumen often masquerades as the source of bleeding. However, when carefully scrolling single images forward and backward, two diverticula could be detected. Although in this case entrance of the diverticula is small, radiating folds guide the diagnosis. During capsule endoscopy, the patient passed larger amounts of blood and required resuscitation with crystalloids and packed red blood cells. Emergency CT angiography showed active bleeding with intraluminal contrast exudation close to an air-filled diverticulum. Like capsule findings, CT localization was proximal jejunum. Hence, push enteroscopy was preferred over readily available balloon enteroscopy. With a variable stiffness pediatric colonoscope, fresh blood in the proximal jejunum was confirmed, now without active bleeding. After cleansing the lumen from blood, jejunal diverticula could be observed. Inside one of the diverticula, a vessel was detected which had not been visible for capsule endoscopy. And finally, three metal clips were placed at the base of the vessel without reactivation of bleeding. Clips were still present at interval surgical resection.